So they played it into overtime, Craig, in the first meeting on opening night. What's in store tonight? Yeah, I think they have a little better idea of what each team brings. Nylander just sidestepped a hit from Josh Anderson as he crossed the trolley tracks. Muzzin sends it into the middle, picked off by Drew Ann, and now Anderson, who scored twice in the opener, right in scores! Through the wickets of Frederick Anderson, and Josh Anderson has scored a minute 16 in. Well, just mentioned turnovers, and it's the turnover by the Leaf in the neutral zone that creates this chance. Muzzin gets the hit there by Anderson, so Anderson creates the turnover with the hit, and then a little give and go with Suzuki in his hot streak continues that's now points in four or five Dermott's in kicks it back Tavares has some jump right now after that 15 minutes in the room Dermott scores Travis Dermott let it fly and has his first of the season But do you have a book on Travis Dermott? I don't think so. Look at the traffic in front and carry Price down. That, that's been one weakness of Price all season long where the pucks have found a way is over the blocker side. This one, just a perfect shot. There's Tavares in with Nylander in the slot. Kicks it back. Justin Hall returns to Nylander. Across it goes. Munson. Club stop. Carey Price. They have 11 goals from their blue line including six from Jeff Petrie. Edmonton also with 11. Here's Justin Hall. Scores! An elite blue liner has given Toronto the lead. And what a play by Hall. You've got four on four where Dermott, as you mentioned, the first one. Watch the hesitation for both Hall in here, and he's going, should I shoot this thing? Nobody's in front. Can I wait? Watch this little hesitation. And then just a rocket. I don't know if Price thought Weber was maybe going to block that. Instead, Weber says, I'll get out of the way. He just absolutely blows it by the glove side of Carey Price. Good mobility across, head up, all delayed. No, you're going to let me shoot. I'm going to take it, and this is a shooter. Alex Kerfoot for Zach Bogosian. Stanley Cup winner with the Tampa Bay Lightning feeds it ahead. Here comes Hyman cutting in, centering it in front, ah! scores! Ilya McCann's got his first. Well, deja vu all over again from Monday night. The momentum swings again. This is just staying with it by Hyman, pulling it to the outside, gets lost for a second, ah! and just what a little chip over play by Kerfoot. And you go to the net, good things happen. Watch the inside position here. Mikheyev gets. Kulak tries to get it with his skate. Can't. He's a little late with his stick. Ben Sherat. Suzuki can't center against Brody. Zatar. Romanov. Sherat. That one bouncing through. Anderson down. And it's in. And the Canadians are within one. And a lot of pressure and so much action in front of the net. Armia in position. It's a double hopper and then the rebound right on the doorstep. You can see it gets deflected here as Sherratt takes the shot. There's the broken stick deflection. Another by Armia and then Tatar on the doorstep. Anderson had already slidden by as his body momentum had taken him. He's expecting to have the puck there. Instead, it's caught between his legs. Hyman along the boards. Weber will knock it off his stick. Jake Muzzin will try the other side. An outlet for Matthews with the empty net. Up ahead for Hyman. And Zach Hyman, a backhand scores. And the Leafs are back in front by two. This is one you just support down low. It's Muzzin who doesn't panic. Look at him put his head up, make the clear outlet pass, and then a backhander by Hyman. He knew the pressure was coming. Hurt as he crashed into those end boards. The Foley swings it in. Clock draining here. Travis Dermott, who got the leaps on the board first, sends it around. It's a Maple Leaf night here in Montreal as they win their 11th of the season.